Welcome to our newest field assistant, a six-legged robot that carries an instrument package to measure winds and sand transport on desert dunes. Sand dune dynamics are controlled by interactions between the wind, sand surface and the morphology of the dune itself. Understanding their dynamics requires that we measure boundary layer winds and rates of sand movement on all parts of the dune during strong wind events. To do this, using existing instrumentation such as cap anemometers and sand traps has many limitations. Installing it is very labor intensive and disturbs the fragile surface of the dune. Once it's installed, it's fixed in space and can only be deployed for a short time. The very existence of the instruments affects the wind field and probably the rates of sand transport that we measure. Most sand transport events are also of short duration and not easily predicted, so it's difficult to be on site to observe and collect data. The dune environment is fragile and easily disturbed by human traffic. It can also be hazardous for humans during transport events. Legged robots are agile and have proved to be able to cope with the dune environment, as well as carrying a valuable instrument package. We now have a new technology to address a central problem in desert research, how to get good measurements in difficult conditions. The robot carries an instrument package to measure wind speed and direction, sand transport, dust emissions, and temperature and humidity. It stores the data in an onboard data logger. Our initial tests at White Sands National Monument have shown that our robot can collect meaningful data on near surface winds as well as sand transport rates. Here we see data collected during a wind event in late March 2016. We can see that the wind speed and the sand flux are very closely correlated and move in sync with each other. We plan more field experiments and improvements to the instrument package. Eventually the robot or its successors will be able to operate autonomously. For example, they could be programmed to go out when the wind exceeds some threshold speed and collect data on sand transport events. There's lots more in this project. We're only really beginning now, and we invite you to learn more and follow the project on our website.